Step one, open the case, removing both front and back panels. Step two, locate the slot for the IO shield and clip it in. Step three, Find the holes for the motherboard on top of the standoffs and screw them in using your hands. Step 4. Place the motherboard on top of the standoffs, press firmly against the I.O. shield and screw it in using your Phillips head screwdriver. Step 5. Locate and open the clasp on the CPU socket. Step 6. Pop the back plastic off the CPU clasp. Step 7. Insert the CPU correctly faced up and clasp it down. Step 8. Go to the back of the case and install your CPU cooler bracket. Step 9. Move to the front of the case and lay it down flat. Step 10. Locate the CPU and apply a dab of thermal paste in the center of the CPU. It should be about the same size as a grain of rice. You'll only need a small dot as it will expand when compressed. Step 11. Line up your bracket and cooler, then proceed to screw your cooler down on top of the CPU. Step 12. Locate the memory slots and determine how many slots you have, that being two or four. Step 13. If there are two slots and you have two cards, unclick both slots. But if there are four slots, then you only unclick slots one and three. Step 14. Insert the RAM into mentioned slots and push down until you hear a click. Step 15. Locate the PCIe connection for the GPU to go and clear an area for it to slot in. This may require unscrewing the side vents and bend or bending them off. Step 16. Unclick the GPU slot and press the GPU in until it clicks. Step 17. Locate an area for your hard drives to go. Step 18. Screw the drivers in and find the area for the SATA ports on your motherboard. Step 19. Click in your hard drive to port 1 using a SATA cable. Step 20. Locate the cables coming from the start button area. Step 21. The 3.0 audio cable clicks into the audio cable slot along with the USB cable, but the controller switches are a little more difficult. Step 22. There should be six plug things with writing on them saying power positive minus reset audio etc these are your control switches if you do not install these correctly your computer will not boot up step 23 read the manual for these connectors or look at your motherboard with a light there will be small writing near the bottom and this will indicate where they need to be slotted in step 24 Move to the back of the case or side depending on your case's design and find the area with four screw holes for your power supply to go. Step 25. Proceed to screw in your power supply and organize your cables. Step 26. Locate the large 16 pin slot on the front side of your motherboard. Step 27. Insert the ATX power cables from the power supply to the aforementioned 16 pin slot on your motherboard. Step 28, locate your PCIe power cables from the power supply, you'll have either two or three. Step 29, connect the CPU cable to the top PCIe looking connection at the top of your motherboard. There may also be a PCIe connection on your graphics card depending on the graphics card. If there is one, make sure to click it in. Step 30. Locate the SATA power cables from the power supply and click it into the back of your hard drive. Step 31. Work out if there are any other miscellaneous power supply cables that need to be plugged in and do so. Step 32. Locate the case fan connections on your motherboard, as usually indicated by the word case fan, usually in small writing on most motherboards. Step 33.
position your fans at the nearest motherboard port, then proceed to screw in your case fans. Step 34. Check your cable management and make sure no cables interfere with components or block fan blades. Step 35. Once everything is checked, put the side back on the case and screw them shut with the thumb screws. No screwdriver is required. Step 36. Connect your computer up to power and make sure that your power supply power switch is turned on. Step 37. Press the power on button. There may be a couple of cutouts when it starts up. If so, not a problem. If everything starts up, no warning lights, and you go to a boot screen, then you're all done. <laughs>